Welcome to Famous Fortunes. I hope you are well. Welcome back to the greatest show on earth. Your host, Lord Famous Fortunes. A little hiccup in the comments section yesterday in one of the episodes. Uh, I don't know why it's happening, but uh, yeah, there was only one episode that could take comments yesterday. I kept turning the comments back on and it just kept turning itself off again. So I don't, I don't know what's going on. That one, but the other episode was all right. Uh, not sure what is going on there. I have no idea what's going on. It's yeah, I think it's it's the YouTube algorithm. It, it's it must be something to do with the algorithm. And I don't know what it is. So uh, I'm sure it all will be revealed in time. Is this happening to anyone else's channel that you're aware of? Then just jump in the comments and let it be known. Rumor has it that the spare is becoming a movie. That's what I'm hearing. The spare movie is going to be coming out now. Uh, who on earth would play Harry is the question I have in my mind. Who would play Harry? Uh, wow. I mean, just to think, just to think, would it be on Netflix? Perhaps. I, I don't know. I have no idea, but I'm, I'm hearing that there is rumors, rumors considering selling the, the film rights to the spare. Uh, I don't know. Would you call it, was it fictional book? I'm not sure. Fictional or non-fictional? I, I don't know. What would you say? Is it is it a biography? Is it an autobiography? Or is it um, something else? I don't really know how to classify it. But let's ask, is Harry considering selling the rights? So let's just see where we're at with this process. Let's throw some cards. What's going on? Is he considering selling the rights? Cards are hot. Ace of coins. Ace of coins. So he's looking for options here. Is the underlying energy. Okay. Ten of swords. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ace of pentacles. Two of swords. Oh boy. Queen of pentacles. Oh, and the king of cups. Okay. Queen of pentacles. Oh, there she is. There she is. Okay. So something looks like, it, it, to me, it looks like there has been searching. There's been searching here for dollars and cents, let's say, for pentacles. There's been a, a search, a quest, a pentacle quest happening. Uh, it looks like there's a woman here that wants a lot of money for this. It's sort of a lot of money. She's really after um, the big dollars for this. Now, it also looks like there's been no takers. No one's interested. And it also looks like uh, they've gotten a lot of no's as well. No, and they want, is it, they want too much money. Basically, that's what it is. They want too much money for the spare. Uh, I don't think they maybe, I don't know, maybe they don't understand how Hollywood works in 2023 these days. You can't just write a book and then sell it, the rights to the movie for unbelievably large amounts of money these days. You can't do that these days. I don't think that's how it works, but okay. Apparently they are um, considering it, they are considering it, uh, yes, I would say yes, I'd say definitely there's, um, there was an attempt here, at least an attempt to do this, are they still trying to do this, let's, let's, let's find out, because it looks like it's been a very unsuccessful search, uh, for the right buyer, are they still trying to, <coughs> to sell the script, excuse me, I need some more tea. Are they still trying to sell the script? Cards are hot. The death card. <laughs> Ten of swords of death. We're definitely onto it. Eight of coins. 
the Fool, the Two of Cups, and the Queen of Cups. Underlying energy again is the Ten of Coins. Are they still? Are they still looking? Are they still look? Well, it looks like they have received. It, to be honest, it looks like it's over. It looks like this whole idea of selling the rights is all... It's, it's, it's dead in the water, but they're still trying in some ways. And the the quest may be a little bit sort of absurd at this point, let's say. An absurd quest. There's a woman here that's very ideologically into this. Again, there's this ten of... You know, this idea of making money is the underlying energy. Uh, are, they, are they flogging a dead horse? That's pretty much... That's pretty much the uh, the vibe I'm getting here. Flogging a dead horse. And that's, you know, a very succinct way of saying these cards. Uh, flogging a dead horse, pretty much. Trying to get every last drop out of it didn't work. I don't think there's a lot of money here. How much, you know, let's just have a look. How much were they expect? Did they receive any offers? Actually, let's ask that question. Did they receive any offers? I want to know exactly how much they want for it. I should probably try and ask. But did they receive any offers? Cards are hot. Page of Cups. Oh, mm, interesting. Underlying energy. Queen of Swords. There she. There's this woman again. We saw almost every variation of the Queen here. Queen of Swords. The Hermit. The Six of Coins. Two of Coins. And the Seven of Coins. Okay, so I think they have received an offer. I think they've weighed... Maybe two offers or they've weighed up the offer. It's been a very, very... Um, let's just say it wasn't a generous offer. It was a very measured... Uh, prude offer, let's say. It was a very calculated, measured offer. It certainly wasn't generous, and it looks like the offer may have been rebuffed. They may they may still be looking at it. I don't know. Here we go with the seven of coins. They may still be looking at the offer, uh, but it also, look, it's not going to work out one way or another. It is not going to work out. I think it wasn't, the offer wasn't high enough. That's pretty much, and there's a woman here that just seems to be the sort of Cobra Commander in, uh, what are those, what's that, Cobra Commander, what's that, um, G.I. Joe, is it, <laughs> Cobra Commander, yeah, Cobra Commander says no on this, I don't know, it just wasn't high enough, I don't think it was high enough, the offer, how much were they after, I wonder, how much money were they after, I, re I really want to know who you think is going to play Prince Harry, got to get in the comments and let it be known. How much were they after? This is going to be very tricky, but we'll see. We'll see. Cards are hot. How much? What's this? The star. Uh, it is... Well, we've got 17 here on the numerology. So, are we talking... $17? $17? $170? $1,700. $17,000. It's got to be more than that. $170,000? Or is it in the millions? I... I I don't know. It would be one hundred and seventy thousand dollars given given that. So I've been one hundred to two hundred thousand dollars. I would say would be most likely. Would they try and sell a movie rights for for seventeen million dollars? Maybe they did, and that's the problem. Queen of Pentacles is the underlying energy. Yeah, again, she wanted too much. So I mean, are we talking? I think a hundred thousand dollars script, two hundred thousand dollars script is probably reasonable. So, you know, in the tens of millions, and really, well, I can just imagine. But he's a prince. He's a prince. He's royalty. I'm a duchess. I'm a duke. I'm royal. No, I don't think so, darling. I don't think so. So, yeah. Not looking very good, folks. Not looking very good. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles again. She wanted too much for it. Absolutely, no doubt about it. In my humble tea-drinking brain, let's say. I was just talking to a friend of mine who's in China at the moment. And uh, he literally said that he is going to bring back some green tea from China. 
Green tea from China. He says, excellent. It is Dragon Well drink, Green Tea he's been drinking, which is one of my favorites. Dragon Well Green Tea from China. Uh, I'm not going to pronounce the region he's in now because I don't want to embarrass myself. But in any event, uh, I'm looking forward to that and we'll have to have a bit of a party there. I'm still looking for... I, I want to ask him to find some tea wear to bring back, but that's a bit hard. I can't ask him to bring, you know... Bring me, like, a, a, a tray back. You know, bring me a tr tea tray. I can't ask that. That's going overboard, isn't it? In it. I think it is. I very much think it is. Very much think it is. All right. So, too much. Too much money. What can I say? Too much money. Now, what can we look at? What can we look at when we're here? I want to read some. Here we go. Chopsticks for legs says, I love Nosy Parker time. I love that comment. What a great comment. I love Nosy Parker time as well. Who were they thinking about getting to play Prince Harry? Let's uh, let's look at that. Who were they thinking? Uh, well, let's see what clues we can get in here because I'm sure they had someone in mind. Robin says, I understand why you turned off the comment section for the King and Biden's secret tales political talk reading. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. I'm telling you, it wasn't me. Uh, it was not me. I encourage comments and all the rest of it. I don't know what's going on, folks. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I think YouTube is just working their algorithm. algorithms. That's all I can think. I don't know what it is. It's just a humble tower reading. I'm not sure what the big deal is. Let's, uh, let's dive in. So who are they going to get to play Harry? Cards on. I'm sure it's fine. Let's have a look. Underlying Energy, the Temperance card. I enjoy reading the comments. I want them to be on. The Chariot. Five of Coins. Three of Coins. They may actually have someone in mind. Or had someone. Four of... Oh, that didn't want to participate. Four of Cups and the Page of Pentacles. The Page of Pentacles. They wanted someone strong, like a strong male lead. A strong male lead. I think this is a prominent person. This is someone who is... I don't know. I'm getting handsome. I'm getting sort of, you know, I'm getting handsome. I'm getting... Uh, well known, I think as well. I'm getting well known. I, I think that no one wanted to actually do it though. I think that whoever they had in mind wasn't interested. They would, yeah, no, 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 no. And actually, maybe the money, the money aspect might have been an issue there. So they wanted to sell the script for a mint, but maybe they did not want to pay for someone decent to play Harry. Perhaps, perhaps, oh, perhaps. Uh, someone here is suggesting, Gwendolyn is suggesting, if I show up at a certain individual's uh, front gate and offer a free reading, that'll get me in. They love free stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, that's hilarious. That is funny as. Show up at the pack of cards. Hey, do you want a free reading? That'd be funny. That'd be funny. Mm. Mm. Yeah, here you go. So... People are asking, oh, where is Harry at the moment? Is he in rehab? A lot of people are saying that. Yes, uh, people also come, uh, more comments about why, what's going on in episode 941. I have no idea what's going on, to be honest with you. As I have mentioned, uh, Mrs. KK says, I learn more on this channel because he uses the Rider Weight deck. There are, there are other readers I like, but I can't learn anything because they use specialty decks I can't follow. It's very true. In the beginning, you really, even myself, I would to pull out some, you know, obscure deck. I'd be like, what is this? You have to just go off the, you know, I mean, you go off the image, but you can go off the, what it is, you know, what card it is exactly. You have to know exactly then. That's very difficult. Better to stick with Rider Weight. Rider Weight, though, is... You got to appreciate if you're a beginning reader, right away it is skewed towards some of the negative meanings of the cards in some of the cards with some of the images. It's generally skewed to the more, more to the more negative interpretations just by what you look at. So, for example, um, for example, the tower. Let's pick up the tower as a good one. This just comes to mind. So, 
the tower comes to mind. The tower can, I mean, look at the tower. It looks pretty bad, doesn't it? It looks pretty, it looks pretty bad. But it can represent, you know, it, it, it can represent a shock to the system, but not all shocks are bad. You know, if you won the lottery, for example, you'd be pretty happy, wouldn't you? But shocked. Do you know what I mean? Something like real shock to set in if you want a good amount of money. And that can be represented by the tower card. Now, does that mean it's a bad thing in and of itself? No, it just represents that shocking, uh, sudden change, if you like, or something that's very unexpected happening. So the look of the card, I mean, falling out of a tower and a lightning bolt hitting it isn't the best ever, but it doesn't necessarily mean negative things all the time. So just there's a little something about right away to, to bear in mind, to bear that in mind. Uh, Chris says Montecito was sold last year. We did see them moving on. I remember that. But uh, a lot of misinformation has been thrown out there. Why the misinformation? Let's ask. Why all the misinformation about the house? What's going on? Yeah, Jamie says, I read the cards that they are both out in the cold with Netflix and they both got the Ten of Swords reputation ruined. Exactly what we saw today. Five of coins. They're kind of on the outs in Hollywood. Ten of Swords, reputation ripped. No one's interested. So there's that. There's that. Okay, so what's the go with all the misdirection about the house? Cards are hot. King of Wands, underlying energy. Ace of Wands. Five of Cups. Ace of Pentacles. A Queen of Swords, the Sun. Why so much misdirection? Because they lost something. It was lost in a way. Lost. And there's a woman here that wants things to appear to be a certain way, appear to be all good, but things weren't all good. In fact, there's, there's, they've lost the house, I think. That's probably what, what I'm seeing. Maybe they weren't able to hold on to the house. That's probably what I'm seeing here. So they had to maybe downsize somewhere, I, I would imagine. Is it, are they downsized somewhere? Does anyone know where they're at at the moment, what type of situation it is? Uh, that would be interesting. In fact, we should probably do an episode on that. I think we should. I think we should. What type of um, what type of situation? Are they in right now? It's a good question. You know what? People keep asking for Marcus Anderson. Is Megan still friends with Marcus Anderson? That's a question, isn't it? Megan and Marcus. Let's do an episode on that. Megan and Marcus. Are they still friendly? Megan's, Megs and Marcus, still besties. We should do an episode on that. I think that's going to be next episode. So, will the spare movie get made? The final, final bonus reading here. Will it get made? I'm sure everyone's dying to see that. Everyone's dying to see that cream on the todge. Oh boy, that's going to be a scene. It's going to be like American Pie if that's included. I mean, that's the literally the 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 level that the t it's going to be American Pie tier. That's what it's going to be. Cards are hot. What do we got? Will it be done? Prince of Cups. The Hierophant. The Lovers, the Four of Wands, strange cards actually, Page of Swords, Underlying Energy is the Ace of Swords. Okay, so there's a desire to get it done, we've already covered that. Will it actually be done? Oh, who's the Hierophant? Is the Hierophant Netflix? Yeah, the Hierophant may be Netflix. The lovers, the lovers, the lovers. Is this going to be... My thoughts here are it's not necessarily going to be 
if it if it's gonna be done, it's not gonna be like they're gonna get actors. It's gonna be like they're gonna get Megan and Harry to do a type of spare book doco. Is that how it's gonna be? Like a home thing starring those two, um, like something that's a light, a very light production. You know, I don't know. I don't say handy cam level, but you know what I'm saying. Like Blair Witch Project of blockbusters. Maybe something like that. Maybe it's on Netflix. I don't know. Possibly with the Hierophant card. And uh, let's, okay, follow up question. Is Netflix interested? Because it's, it's some type of institution. Is Netflix interested in having a spare doco on their platform? A spare movie, let's say. Cards are hot. Uh, <laughs> Eight of Swords, the High Priestess, the Seven of Coins, the Two of Cups, Three of Swords, uh, Nine of <laughs> Wands. Okay, so what I'm seeing here is that Netflix, this wasn't Netflix's first option, that's for sure. They weren't, they weren't dying for this, that's for sure. But maybe it's all, that, and this is kind of what they're going to be stuck with. That's the energy I'm getting. It's kind of like they don't want it. I'm getting here they don't want it, but they may be sort of stuck with it. Maybe it's a contract. They're looking at the contract or they're trying to review what's going on, trying to get out of it. Maybe, I don't, I'm not sure. But there's an idea here that this did not work out as expected for Netflix. They, uh, they wouldn't have signed up to this idea in the first place. That's what I'm seeing. They wouldn't have signed up for this in the first place. So let that be known. I... Can't wait to see you in the comments. <laughs> I can't wait to see you in the comments. Oh, boy. We'll see what happens tonight. See you down there.